I can remember it very vividly, uh, like it was yesterday. My wife told me, hey, David Howes on the phone, and I remember picking up the phone, and I, David goes, Ralph Spry, David Housel. I said, how you doing, Mr. Housel? He said, how fast can you say War Eagle? I said, War Eagle. He said, there's my new head coach. And I said, all right, then let's go. I do come to work every day excited and amped up about what I'm doing and, and what we're trying to do with, uh, with the group that we're around. When you're around people with energy, talented people that have goals and ambitions, and again, you're going to be a part of that uh, tool to help them achieve those goals, it just, you know, it's almost impossible not to get up full of energy and excited about every day. My background, you know, I was a world-class athlete, I was a national champion, so all the things I'm trying to get these athletes to do, I was fortunate to experience. You know, and nothing can replace experience. So, so I was fortunate from that standpoint, being an officer in the U.S. Army and be able to lead troops. All that really comes to play with what I do at Auburn. Uh, certainly, I feel we have a lot of accolades. The NCAA run up three or four times, but, but I think certainly uh, in any sport, um, I'm, I'm, I'm a firmly believer that the toughest thing to do is win a national championship. And we are fortunate to do that, and I think that that's something that speaks volumes, you know, uh, and they don't just give those things away, so that's something that's going to be always special to me, and something that we can always, that will always be in Auburn, will always be the first uh, national championship track and field team, and that's something that can never take away that will be a, a legacy of its own. I realize, you know, Auburn has had six coaches win national championships, and I, I was the third coach to win a national championship, but also the first black coach to win a national championship at Auburn. To be the first, I feel honored to have been that person to do that, but also know that I think it just shows again that the environment Auburn is that it really doesn't matter if, if you got the desire and, and you know and you want to do well, you certainly have the uh, the backing, the resources, you certainly have the family atmosphere that will allow you to win a national championship. When you think about Ralph Spry, I mean, obviously I, I expect him to see the accolades we've had, championships, all those things. But I want to remember somebody that really cared, truly cared, and was always there for them. You know, championships can be can be won. Records can be broken, but when you establish relationships, those are things, like I said, that, that will be lifelong yeah. lasting. John, hey John. Inspired me a lot, thank you. I'm, I'm always gonna be Coach Spry, you know, and uh, I'm always gonna be an Auburn Tiger. So that's always gonna be special, but I just decided, you know, uh, it's time to write another chapter in my life. And I have some things I still want to do and I, some things I want to accomplish. So I, I think it's just time, now's a good time to, to uh, you know, turn the program over. When I look at it from that lens, uh, I still feel excited and I'm, I'm still happy because I'll be Auburn's biggest fan across the board. And I certainly want to uh, thank uh, the Auburn family, all the athletes, uh, the, the co-workers, the staff, people that really supported us over the years. Because again, uh, to me, that is, that's the most special part, the relationship. So uh, you know, from the bottom of my heart, I'm really, really honored and I'm certainly become a, such a great person, greater person because of being a part of Auburn. And I think, I, I think that that is what allowed me to, to be successful, not just my ability to coach or the ability to recruit or the or staff we have, it's, it's the environment. Auburn is a special place, you know. Uh, the Auburn plain, here in the Plains is, is really special. And I wouldn't, uh, in 25 years, if I could do anything over again, I wouldn't change a thing. I, I mean, that, that's how special it's been with the Auburn people, with Auburn support and the Auburn family, because it is real here in Auburn. War Eagle.